Welcome to Urban Knife Guy, where we explore the urban knife style and jungle survival. Today we're not in the jungle, but we're going to have a look at my EDC Tech Gadget Pouch. Now this is something I need when I go out for client work, and it's really to support my IT needs, and it might be useful to you as well. First, if you watch this channel regularly, but have not subscribed, please do so to help the channel out. Thanks. So first, some contacts now, I don't work in an office, but I often do need to see clients and make presentations. And this is to support those needs. But I believe this might be useful to a lot of people who work in the office or work at home and work with laptops and devices and need some kind of support. And this is what this EDC Tech Gadget pouch was put together for. You might have already noticed the morale patch on the front of the pouch. I have different morale patches for my different pouches to distinguish them and also I guess just for a bit of levity and as you can see for this one I just think this is such a considerate uh, morale patch once again and it's telling the person who's reading it to avoid injury don't tell me how to do my job and there's a legitimate reason for that because my job is so complicated if you try to tell me how to do it you might get a headache so I really don't want you to get any headache and honestly I don't know what I'm doing half the time so how can I expect anyone else to know as well and another safety warning here Obviously, you can see this guy's face got in the way of this wrench. So if you ever see someone throwing wrenches, doing wrench throwing practice, please don't walk in that line of fire. After all, if you're at a gun range, you don't walk down in front of the targets as well, right? So the same concept applies. So really great patch here, uh, full of good considerate warnings. Now this pouch is the Viperate VE10. I've done a review on this previously, so check out the video in the card above or the description below. So it zips all open. Now it's pretty light, even though it looks a bit bulky, but it doesn't really have to be heavy because this is not really a hardcore uh, tool pouch with heavy tools. It's really just useful stuff that you would need around the office, or as I mentioned, if you need to do some kind of a presentation to link up with a projector, laptop, etc. So let's start from left to right. Starting over here, I've got a flashlight. This is the Olight i3T. And often you might need to look for maybe plugs or cables or things that drop behind the desk. So that uh, can be used to find that. And I've got a pen over here. Now, when I go for long meetings, I do not want to use a small three inch EDC pen, which I carry in a lot of my loadouts. I want a full pen and this one extends to a really comfortable full pen. So if I'm in a multi hour meeting, I've got a good pen with me. Over here, I've got a USB port, and really this is a hub where I can connect HDMI cables, a USB, a Type-C, and really when I go for presentations and I need to link my laptop to a projection system, this is where it comes in handy. Over here in the center, I have a USB flash drive and it's on an s so I can easily take that out and it's double-headed so I can use it uh, both the regular USB as well as the micro USB. So that becomes uh, really handy uh, for transferring data if there's no cloud or Wi-Fi enabled. Now on the right over here, I have uh, a small multi-tool. Now I don't carry a full knife simply because that's on my separate EDC. This is really specific for tech gadgets. And I've chosen the Gerber Dime because I think uh, it's nice and sleek. It's got all the different things I might need. Uh, generally, again, working with devices, I might need small screwdrivers. I might need a small pair of pliers. Uh, that's why I didn't choose, let's say, the Splice or the Leatherman Micra, which is a pair of scissors. I felt the pliers uh, really uh, comes in more useful for my needs. On the right over here, this is uh, basically a PowerPoint clicker. Uh, so when I do presentations, once again, this is uh, linked up to my laptop uh, through that Bluetooth uh, USB, and uh, I can do my presentations effectively hands-free. Now at the back over here, some just some utility items. Probably the most important is this cable card. So the cable card is a very cool little system. It's a card, but as you can see, it's got a whole bunch of different cables and heads. So there's one main cable, as you can see, that goes around there. And then you've got all the different head attachments for different devices. So that, again, becomes very useful depending on devices and systems that you're trying to be compatible with. Uh, there's also an SD card extractor over here. And if you have micro uh, 
HD or SD cards rather, memory cards, you can put them into these slots over here. And the great thing about this, if you plug this to your laptop or a power bank, you can also have a reading light if you need. Um, not so much uh, useful in uh, meetings, but if you ever work events, let's say conferences, and uh, you are, let's say, a guest speaker, or maybe you're just working uh, as part of the team. Now, the conference hall might be darkened because there's a presentation going on and you might need some kind of light uh, where just so they can refer to notes and then it's not so practical just to be holding your flashlight all the time. Uh, this kind of a uh, portable desk lamp, uh, which is uh, very inconspicuous and doesn't really have a bright light. You can kind of just adjust it so it's, you know, there's a bit of covering and that becomes very useful as well. So this is the cable card, uh, cable card with the K. And I think this is a very useful device for any kind of uh, EDC tech gadget pouch. And finally, the last utility item is just some duct tape. I've got about five feet here and it's wrapped, wrapped around. This is already gaffer's tape, not duct tape because uh, there's less residue. And this can be used again uh, for major, you know, many, many different things. Um, put down cables, repair stuff, and it's just good to have that here as part of this kit. And there you have it. This is my EDC Tech Gadget Pouch. If you think there are any other gadgets that could fit inside and would complement the system, please let me know your thoughts in the comments below. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you like the content in general, please subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell. Thanks for watching. Talk to you soon.